Now, fellas, I've been here in merry old England for over a year now, and I want to dive even more into British culture. And with Halloween coming up, it's the perfect opportunity. The players nailed their bye-bye-bye choreo for Dr. Sharon. Now, it's our turn. So for our group costume, I was thinking we could be the Spice Boys. What a stupid idea. Come on, what could be more British than the Spice Girls? I think we're gonna need the big guns for this. Exactly, Mundo coach. Another meeting of the Diamond Dogs is now in session. Woo! <laughs> now, I don't know how y'all celebrate here, but in the US of A, Halloween is more sacred than praying to Nick Saban at Sunday Mass after Alabama beat Auburn for the SEC West Division title. Terribly sorry, Ted, but I don't speak American football. Nick Saban's basically modern day Jesus Christ in America. Huh. I would have guessed Jared Leto. The Holland costume's always been shy boy. Oi, Halloween is the stupidest holiday. Humiliating yourself over and over in front of strangers' front doors for a tiny piece of candy. Sometimes you'll get a whole regular sized bar. If I wanted a fuckload of candy, I just stole from my sister. All right, now who's which fast boy? You know, I've got a pretty good streak going with my shy boy costume. I'm already doing a group costume with my family. Oh, come on. This is your culture. If you hate the Spice Girls, then do you hate David Beckham? No, I suppose no. It is the perfect group costume. Everybody loves the Spice Girls. Who wouldn't love the Spice Boys? Me. Dibs on Ginger Spice, baby. What? I wanted to be Ginger Spice. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, you got a strong case there. Gingers have more fun anyway. I suppose it's so obvious. I don't even have to say it, but I'm definitely Posh Spice. Yeah, why is that? Because I too have a melodic baritone voice and I would marry David Beckham. First chance I get. Since I'm the coach, I guess that makes me Sporty Spice. Got my costume already, hot dog. Hold on, I'm... I'm sporty too, sporty enough to get promoted from kit manager to assistant coach. Sorry, Nate. You know, Ted's coached both versions of football. Call me Sporty Spice because I'm spicier than some buffalo wings you gotta sign a waiver for in Death Valley. Ooh wee! Who's left? Baby Spice and Scary Spice. Who should be Scary Spice? <clears throat> Oi! I don't understand why I'm scary, Spice. I'm a fucking nice lad. Yes, totally. Yeah, totally. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah, oh yeah, totally, totally. That leaves baby Spice. Hey, just because I'm the smallest doesn't mean I'm baby Spice. And I sure as hell wouldn't look good in, in pigtails and a mini skirt. Now, Nate, I think that would blind everyone on the team. But hell, if it ain't a great strategy for our next game at Tottenham. If we can't beat them, we'll blind them. The Diamond Dogs have struck again. Oh!